Hey guys, Riske here, and welcome, finally, to my playthrough of Tomb Raider 3. Um, so, if you're new here, welcome. Um, I played through the first two games years ago. Those are on my channel. Uh, since they did the remaster, I've been able to go back and do the expansion packs for those two games, so I finished those, checked that out. And now we're finally here to do Tomb Raider 3. We're gonna go ahead and do this with the OG graphics for consistency's sake, um, and then once we get to Lost Artifact, then I will uh, jump back to the, the new fancy graphics. So, all right, let's jump in and do this. Let's do this thing, y'all. I'm so excited. <clears throat> yelling myself hoarse on this radio every day. It's just the weather dumps on us frequently here. And maybe my transmission doesn't get through. I don't know. I can't understand one word of what you say, Willard. It's all going swell, sir. Get the bit up. Get it out. Turn it off. Check out site two. What about this? Blow through it. Find more meteorites. <laughs> nah, something a little younger than that. Oh no! Billy! I don't want you to say that explosive, do you hear me? I do not want you to say that explosive! <laughs> Wretched pyros. This place is a busy history. I love that you can count <laughs> the different uh, pixels. Oh, it's amazing. Okay, I feel pretty confident with this level after all of the times I've played through it when trying to test emulators and shit and just... Nothing ever fully worked and it was very unfortunate. Um... Where the fudge are those? Okay, there they are. It's like, where is this shit? Damn. I am gonna go ahead and keep, uh, keep like the little icon for when you can pick stuff up because it just makes life so much easier. I feel like the devs would want me to keep it in. And I'm going to go ahead and keep captions on just for, you know, people might be watching that are hearing impaired in some way, shape, or form. So still want them to be able to enjoy it. But yeah, I'm so excited to finally, finally be playing this <laughs> at long last. First death already. Okay, not, oh, whoop. I just wanted to skip. That's all I wanted to do. But yeah, how are you guys? How's life? How are things? Are you excited? Are you excited we're finally on three? At long last? I've wanted to play it for so long. And I've never 
played Lost Artifact. I've never seen anything about Lost Artifact. So that's going to be like a completely blind playthrough for me. So I, I'm, I'm pumped. I'm pumped for it. Try this again. There we go. That's better. I think I missed an item. No? I thought there was another pickup. Okay, I guess not. And then, thankfully, we don't actually need the safe crystals. That's gonna make this playthrough so much simpler for me because <laughs> we don't have limited saves god fucking damn it <laughs> i knew that that was a bad idea i knew it and i still did it that's what's so sad and right after i was like i feel confident about my skills in this in this level i've done it so many times it's like good god well then pull yourself together i was gonna do a swan dive i'm like let me not snap laura's neck right now let me just not it's not necessary you know Up. Give me these shotgun shells. I will take literally all of them. Because, yeah, Tomb Raider 3 is tough. It is not an easy game. By any stretch of the imagination. Okay, dope. Dopity dopity dope. Let's go ahead and get our third secret already. I think, I think the third secret's over here. Yeah, I thought so. That's what I thought. Is there anything up here? I forget. We'll never know. Okay. It doesn't appear to be. But you know, it never hurts to double check. I will say, pixels and all, I still love these graphics. It was hell impressive for the time. This came out in what, 99? I was not old enough to understand this game, but it didn't stop me from trying. I don't even think I made it this far. Before I was like, okay, what's the skip level cheat? Did y'all back in the day have those, uh, those big ass books full of cheat codes? They would like divide it up by, uh, by console and then by game. Cause I mean, this was back in the day before Google took over. That was rude. That was really rude, dude. So I'm not gonna kill the monkeys in this level. Because there's no need. They're nice little guys. Future levels, fuck those bastards. They're dying. Okay, I do want to light a flare. I know that there's an easily missable item. There it is. Sounds great. Nice, nice. Okay. 
back here. Now this is open. That could have been ugly, but it wasn't. Because again, I know this level pretty damn well. Were zip lines the thing into? Yeah, they were. They were at least in Golden Mask. I remember that pretty well. Are we about to get our first actual enemy? I think we are. I will say, I like Lara's uh, pistols in this one. Oh, why'd you, why'd you want to quit, Lara? Girl, be for real right now. I'm pretty sure there's an item up here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. More importantly, oh shit. Lara, come on. took it. Damn it. Oh, that sucks. I should have gotten that one first. That was so dumb. Oh well. It's fine. It's not that deep. Why would... Why? Lara, why? Okay, I will take this. Oh, did he put it there? Or is that always there? I'm guessing he put it there, because I don't remember there being a small medipack there. And here's over here if you want to play with the piranhas. I don't care to do so, so I'm not going to. Yeah, I'm going to try and refrain from looking at the walkthrough too much. I am going to look for secrets. Because we're doing all secrets, because that's the only way you can unlock the, the true final level. But other than that, I am, I'm going to try and hold off on checking it too much. But some of these later levels get confusing as hell, so it may not last. Alright, come on, I know there's another one of you. Come on. I know you're there. May as well just take care of you now. This music is epic, though. I love the soundtrack for this game. Tomb Raider games just usually have bomb soundtracks. Like, even though I don't care much for, like, the newer Tomb Raider games... They also do have good soundtracks, so I will, I won't begrudge them that. Another little friendly monkey. I feel okay. There's shotgun shells, but I feel like there's also a small many pack around here somewhere. But maybe not. Maybe I'm crazy. I could definitely be imagining that. We can now crawl, so that's fun. That's a fun addition. Come on, I know you're coming, bitch. such a bang. Y'all, oh my god. Real Housewives of Salt Lake City starts this week. I'm so excited. Like, two days. Two more days. Three more until I can finally watch it on Peacock. 
I'm so excited. It's gonna be so fun. Okay, we're gonna, gonna go ahead and go for the secret first. Just because I know it's there. And we're gonna do our first save. Yeah. So I'm like, this cuts it, right? Yes. So there's a little bit of backtracking this way, but it's just, I wanna make sure I get this and don't forget. Because I would absolutely forget. Okay, got some, what are those, M16 clips? And some flares, don't mind if I do. Back it up. Back it on up. We are just getting pickups out the ass, and I love it. So, question for the Tomb Raider fans out there. What was your first Tomb Raider game that you played? I think the first one that I played, that at least that I can remember playing, is Angel of Darkness, and that was what got me into Tomb Raider. Because I'm pretty sure... I think, like, my mom might have played it. Might have played, like, two or three first. Um, but I don't remember. I do remember I found two at a Dollar General. So I got it. And then I think two is the second one I tried to play. Didn't get far. Thankfully I had my, my big ass book of cheats. Yeah, I actually didn't beat two, like legitimately until like 2017. <laughs> like right before I played it for the channel. Or maybe it was for the channel. No, cause I wasn't blind, Never mind. But yeah, that's why I have kind of a soft spot for Angel of Darkness. Because is it a terrible game? No, it's really not. It went through, it just, it, it got screwed. If the movie hadn't been about to come out and Eidos didn't rush core and try to force them to release a, an unfinished game, I legit think it could have been one of the best entries in the series easily. Unfortunately, they were rushed, and we got a buggy, unfinished mess. But it had so much potential, and its soundtrack is one of the best in the series. And I actually liked its story. I liked that it was different. It was different. It was a little spooky. It was a little twisted. I was always kind of confused, because... You know, well, I don't want to spoil. We'll talk about it when we get there. I was just kind of confused because it felt like there was outside information that we needed to know that we didn't know. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, I was like, um, should a little flare. But it's okay, we'll light one now. Okay, let's get this other secret. Oh wait, no, these are rockets. That's what they are. And then of course we got the harpoons. Still can't see a damn thing. Okay, now this part always gives me trouble. I mean, but I guess I don't need to go over there for the... 
for the crystal. I really only do it just because I like the saves, but I guess I don't need to. But I'm going to do it anyway, because who knows? It might come in handy. Okay, nice, nice. That worked out well. Um, yes. I was like, should I go this way? And yes, yes I should. Yeah, you don't scare me, bitch. Okay, well that was unfortunate. I don't think you can get me from here, can you? Okay, well I also can't get you, so that's a problem. Really? You're hiding out? This is what we're doing now? Where are you, you asshole? God damn! <laughs> Stop hiding! Okay, cool. I feel good moving on. Yeah, I know there are three boulders. I think we're good. I think we're saved. Right. Right, 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 right. Whoop. Totally would have missed this item. If not for the little icon. That's why we're keeping it. Okay. This is mine. Thank you. This is also mine. I do appreciate that in this game we do get actual items uh, for secrets again. Because we did not get that into. As cute as the little dragons were, they just weren't as useful as actual items. Okay, I don't think there are any other items back here, so I think we're good. And is that five out of six? Oh, six out of six. We got all the secrets. Nice. Hells yeah. Sounds good to me. Is there an item here? No? Thought there was. Damn. This bastard probably took it. Did you take it, you bastard? Okay, is there anything back over here? Yes. Thought so. Yeah, this is going to be a long intro episode. I just, I want to go ahead and just knock out the first level. Because it's not really a long level, especially in comparison to future levels. <laughs> Some of the levels in this game are very, very long. But it's okay. Because it's still fun. Oh shit, I haven't taken a hit yet. What's wrong with me? Oh my god, okay, so I went to the Green Day show. It was so good, y'all. If Green Day... Um, they, I think their tour is kind of on its last final, like, big leg or whatever. But uh, if you somehow have the chance to go, and they come to your town, do it. You will not regret it. It was so good. Like, for some older guys, they can still rock. And the stage presence. This, we were at the SoFi Stadium, and it's huge. And they commanded that fucking room. And it was packed. So don't try to let anybody tell you that Green Day's irrelevant. Cause it was packed as hell in that stadium. Like, when I went to see Fall Out Boy, I was sitting in the nosebleeds, and uh, most of my section was kind of close to empty. 
not the case at Green Day. We were still in the nosebleeds, but it was... There were a lot of people there. And it's just like, the energy was so infectious. And yeah, it was, it was fantastic. So if you're able to go, I highly recommend it. It's so worth it. They sound exactly like they do on their records. And it's just like, they, they really are a, like a phenomenal live band. So yeah, but um, my dumbass, I, we took a hit. Um, so I went with a friend and we took a hit. So that was stupid. Before we went to our Uber. And if I was smart, um, I would have remembered that SoFi has a clear bag policy. I didn't bring my clear bag because I can't find it. I have one. I just don't know where the fuck it went. And so, uh, I was a little... Where's this go? I don't remember this. Probably because it's irrelevant. Yeah. Avoid at all costs. Um, my dumbass completely forgot that I shouldn't take my purse with me. So I took my purse with me and I had to throw it away because I wasn't about to pay 20 something bucks for bag check. And we got there pretty late. So I mean, maybe they wouldn't have noticed. Um, but still, I just, I didn't want to risk it. So I just threw it away. There wasn't really anything important in it aside from my vape. So that was the unfortunate thing. How do I, why am I blanking? Ah, okay, doy. So I had to go get a new vape. So this is the new vape. And honestly, I needed a new one anyway, because the old one was kind of not working as well. And so it was time for a new one anyway. I still had half of that cart left. So that was unfortunate, but it's okay. See, I need to take a puff off my shiny new vape. All right, there we go. So that, yeah, that just opened the thing, right? Just in case it didn't. Okay, cool. <laughs> it's like, just in case I'm not doing this right. Excuse me, everybody. Is this the, I was about to say, is this where the tiger is? Yep. Ask and you shall receive. Really, bitch? Come on. Don't be a pussy. But um Real talk, though. I've never understood using pussy as an insult. Those things push out whole, full living beings. Why would you use it to refer to someone as weak? Th those things take a beating. Like <laughs> You breathe the wrong way on a dude's balls and he's like doubled over in pain, so. But yet, having balls is referred to as being tough, so it's, it's very backwards, you know? Very, very backwards. Oh, shit. Oh, okay, whatever. We're at the end of the level anyway. Let's see. You're not slick, huh?
we did that pretty pretty efficiently. I'm impressed. I'm proud of us. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, I almost killed us off right there and then. Hello? Hello? What? What do you want from me now? Nothing that taxing. Are you alright? Well, if you'd all stop, I might be just fine. Just a hundred percent. Just go! If you'd all stop, who are you talking about? All you hundreds of you talking and chattering and breaking my brain up. Hmm. Well, I'm not quite sure where you're coming from. But I just want to know about the Infada artifact. In the temple up there. <laughs> voodoo magic and all, huh? I don't touch this stuff myself. It's not voodoo. Look, is there anyone else here with you? Yeah, Randy and Rory. <laughs> Randy and Rory? Where? What are you all doing here? Well, they're staying put in that temple. I told them not to. I warned them first. Not doing much now, I doubt, under half a ton of mudslide. Me. I'm leaving. Next bus out. This jungle is rooted enough rot into me. I'd offer the same advice to you, but you don't seem like the type to take it. To care if I said you're gonna die in there. <laughs> yeah. Die. What a fucking lunatic. All right. Well, I'm pretty proud of us. And I think on that note, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, share this with your friends, hit the bell so you don't miss an upload, and I'll see you guys next time.